Is this working? I don't. There we go. Now it's working. How do you like that picture? I like that picture. That is the muse for my nano, which I'm not doing much of. I got maybe we're on Turkey Day, which is the 26th of November, and I haven't quite reached um, 15,000 words, so that's no good. Been sick, got sick again, thinking it might be COVID. Got tested, came back negative. Mm. I'm eating stuffing I just made. Not stuffed into anything, it's more like dressing. Dressed on nothing. Switches by itself. Sage, sausage kind of thing. I lost the recipe, family recipe, so I did it from memory. Mm. Certainly lacking things. Um, I think the proportions are wrong, but it's still pretty good. And the smell was almost right, and the smell's important. Because the smell will either break me and make me ball my eyes out for the next hour or five, or bring me comfort and make me feel like I'm not entirely alone in the universe. COVID does things to you. So there you have it. Hmm. Let's see. Um, now, I don't think I want to look at that text. Because I feel like very, I feel like it's an uncomfortable thing to do for me. Hmm. My arm, my upper left, right arm, is bothering me because, um, well, for some weeks now, actually, I don't rightly know why. I don't recall that it is um, related to my first bout with the cooties, the 2020 cooties. But it might have been. I don't know. Maybe. You know what? I want to try something. Well, why not? Not try something. Control D. All right. Let me put something in the notes here. Hang on. See, it's um for um just before fourteen eighteen personal stuff appears. I know I have an editor in there somewhere, hopefully. But yeah, I'm gonna edit some of this obviously or I will have by the time I post it because personal stuff appeared. And I don't want to have personal stuff showing. That's okay. Hmm. I'm mm, still eating this. The dressing wasn't too bad. The um, I used uh, Granny Smith apples. Real good for pies and the like. I mean, real tart. Mm. And here they provide a not a strong sweetness, uh, but a texture. I'm not really as fond of apples for this kind of thing, but it just makes sense to put it in there. Mushroom, mm, onion. Sausage, sage, not a sage. And the sausage itself didn't come with sage. It wasn't a sage sausage stuff. So. Um, what is a sage sausage uh, dressing? What else? Um, bread, of course. I didn't have any leftover bread. I had to use stuff that I bought from the store. What else? Um, I forgot to put the. I got raisins. I forgot to put the raisins in. I'm not fond of raisins in the stuffing, but dressing it. But it's just what I, you know, comfort food. Um, oh yeah, I uh, made some chicken stock, put that in there. Um, I didn't make a turkey or anything like that because just, no, not, not, not something I'm too worried about. Okay, let's go here. So what am I going to do? Let's, let's have a little bit of fun for the heck of it. Um, Done this before, haven't I? Yeah. Uh, okay. Let's see what we get. Well, if 
at the start. Oh, it's doing its thing. It's going to take a bit. I hope it didn't cause you guys problems with the video because I'm having all this at once. All right, so I don't remember what the current state is. I'm not going to worry about it. Oh, let's try. Hmm. Challenges I don't think I can do. I don't remember how to do a lunar transfer. And it would take... Um, That's stuff I don't know how to do yet, and I need to relearn or learn how to do it. Try to do something interesting. Mm. Oh, I just want to play. What's this one? Oh. Hmm. All right, we'll try that. A simple enough. It's been. Uh, let's see if I can remember. I didn't this. I haven't played this in a couple of days, a couple of weeks. Let's see what we're looking at. All right. Well, you can move my uh, band went. All right. Let's see what we're looking at. This I can't remember how to use this um, glide slope kind of thing or not glide slope. I think this indicates your. Um, how far you are from the center of wherever the hell you are. I don't know. Oh, shit. Machine language. I'm going to explain this. Uh, I've moved, ooh, orbit and surface. I, I know some of these things. These little dots, these squares mean my landing gear's down. All right. Let's, um, let's look on the outside here. Oop. Actually, I think, oh, there we go. I can use the mouse wheel. Um, all right. Here we are, this is us. You can see um, there's a building, and we're gonna fly into the sky if I wanna. Oh, and in, okay, let's see. Global frame. Okay, so relative position means when, right up here, that says that when this is flying and turning, the whole camera follows exactly the same way. It's kind of disconcerting. Um, chuta. A global, uh, well, uh, absolute direction means supposed to be is pointing the same way, but when the plane turns and such, the camera's frame of reference moves in a weird way. Now I don't understand that. And this is global frame, which is annoying because you can't, like, you can't control exactly how things move. Look at that. I can't make it, I don't know, it's just a pain in the ass. You can't make it go in the right way and suddenly you're behind it, underneath it. It's a pain. I just don't like it. You're stuck. So screw that. All right. So um, I remember some. Let's. Uh, oh yeah, different cockpits. This is the glass cockpit, or the the real the the pretend real cockpit. And there are some uh, controls there. You can you can uh, retract the HUD, which is this. It has a display. That's kind of cool. Let's extend it. Come on now. Oh, for frack's sake. There we go. There we go. Wrong button. Okay, and then you have um, these. I no clue. Um, you can open the hatch, and if you do that, you get this thing at the top. That thing opens, which. Um, that little guy. Is there anyone in there? Uh, I see someone there. There's somebody. Right there. I like somebody else in there. Hard to tell. Let's go ahead and um, close it. Ah, oh, there you go. And I don't know how to do this by... Uh, oh, there's a little ladder that goes up. I don't know how to do that by... Um, um, Cuts or whatever. All right, we're not going to worry about that. Come out. All right. Um, let's look at the different versions. There's this cockpit, which is let you do this, but it, it brings up the two main displays. And you can, of course, turn off the power here and here just to look at everything. And the HUDs are docking, orbit. Earth, your position in Earth orbit. Uh, I don't know what this stuff does. Though. This is, yeah. And then 
your altitude and your position surface of the earth and your speed um, oh yeah surface and then of course we have this version and this version of the cockpit is nice let me turn these back on because it gives you all of the controls in an easy to access way the hover jets for this particular thing um, I don't know if the propellant is set for anything or not <laughs> oh well um, real wheel brakes are okay yeah it's a comma and period and then the doors how do I open them oh oh there we go ah yeah there we go hold on let's, let's see you have to do it this way there we go now I'm upside down why I don't know these are the retro doors here you can use it to you have retro rockets that way because when you're in space you're wanting to go backwards sometimes let's go ahead and uh, close those again there we go jeez. Uh, oh, oh yeah and there are the uh, hover jets there I'm not going to do the hover thing at least not yet and what else um, oh scram jets which this doesn't have gear which you geez uh, I know the is that I can hit G for that Ma these are the um, left and right thrusters and then you can pull back retro thrusters when the doors are open oh, and then the nose cone oh that's the ladder though how do you turn it open oh nose cone open close there you go hold on there you go see that there's the nose cone opening and that's where you dock when you're docking to a space station right there right there right now let's close that again for Franken's sake is it closing or not okay it's taking forever ain't it holy mackerel All right. Um, this, of course, you can move out of the way. It takes a while. Uh, you can't. Yeah, yeah. It takes forever to do because you have to use the arrow keys. I don't know how to do it faster. Um, but it's useful. All right. So here are HUD adjustments. You can do it this way. And color. I can't remember how to do color um, automatically. I know there are ways to change the color. I have it on orange because it's easier to see in most cases. I think it defaults to green. Huh. And then control. Oh, this is supposed to hold your altitude and all, which is uh, great. But um, there we go. Let me check some. Uh, but this is supposed to say tell you what altitude you want. The dang display doesn't work. Why is a frack out of me? All right. Well, let me do something. Let, let's do this. Um, I'm gonna go to this one. Uh, a problem with this is it doesn't have all the all the different um, controls aren't the same in this version and here's where you have to do uh, some of the uh, controls and, and you can't see them they're hidden in the butt oh look I wonder who these folks are <laughs> they look like uh, actual human beings that you know real people maybe that uh, whoever uh, I don't know who that is oh, how funny all right, all right. Let's see. Uh, Forty field of view. Uh, go wide enough. Sixty. Uh, let's go there. Oh no! You could do a really tight end. That would be kind of useless. So we're gonna go here. All right. Well then, let's go ahead and. Um, how are we doing? Looks like we're not gonna die yet. Coming to the end. I'm gonna pull up. I have no idea my speed. It's uh, pretty fast. So and let's try it. Not bad. Okay. Now let's um pull up the gear. And you're going up, nice. 
All right, I'm going maximum speed. I don't need to go maximum speed. So let's go ahead and reduce it. Um, now I can do it a couple ways. Oh, shoot, I forgot. Let me do it this way. Oh, so we can see it this way. We're going to reduce it to, I'm not sure what that is. So, let's see. Here it says, um, here I, I can actually hold control minus and lower it. So I'm going to take it to about half, see how that goes. Now we're, it looks like we're turning slightly, so. Let's go ahead and make a lazy kind of turn. Now the problem is if I had a joystick I could control it better, but I don't, so. Oh yeah, yeah. This indicates the direction of movement. This is actually my velocity um, related to the surface of the local bo body, which is the Earth at this point. Um, let's see. Okay, PG means prograde, which means I'm on the orbit somewhere that away. It looks like. Um, Oh, now I'm going retrograde right now. That means I'm going the opposite of the direction of orbit, but that's okay. Did I come from down there? I think I came from down there. All right. I'm gonna kill it. All right. I just killed the. I'm gonna not gonna land because I probably crashed. Doesn't matter. I I don't think it's set up to damage, to simulate damage or anything like that. So. Well, that's not it. Where the heck am I? Oh, for crying out loud. Um, all right, you know what I need to do? Let me go ahead and uh, get myself up again. Oh, I'm getting close. I saw my shadow. I'm going to do it this way. Cheating like mad. Oh, wait, there it is. See when I turn the see I turn this and um or and, and the whole camera angle goes whack a mole and I don't know why. So I think it's right over there, so let's see what we get. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there we go. See this? That I think is our runway. Just wish I could make heads or tails of how that works. See, look at that. That slows right in the middle. I have, oh, no, I, I don't know what that means. I just don't. Oh dear, my altitude there. <laughs> I'm going to lower it. and burn here. Let's go ahead and uh, see if I can make a reasonable flyby of some buildings for no good reason. That'd be kind of fun. If I actually had internet access I could, you know, experiment with those online doohickeys and stuff. I do not, so I can't. So there. Tis my life. Oh, I'm on orbit. Oops. Oh, no, 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 no. I do not want to put my... Oh, dear. There we go. 
<laughs> wrong heads up display. How do I get rid of this thing? This dang mouse, I hate that. I have issues with that. Um, there's a combination of, I think it's related to OCD and sensory issues with my brain. That means that I not only get bothered by visual things, I notice them, but I have a physical sensation. So I see and I feel the moving little doohickey, the, the uh, cursor and all. And I'm hiccuping too. Oh dear. All right, hang on. Let's come in. Yeah, I'm coming in. Ooh, Nelly. Now we should be able to see. Hang on. Oh, 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 oh. oh. <laughs> Don't want to crash, do I? Oh, no, crashing would be fun. Oh, Jesus darned. Oh, see that? Let's get really close. Keep my um, um, movement indicator from being too low because my altitude is going down. I need to. Whoa, geez, oh Pete. All right, so that's not so good, is it? Well, it's kind of cute. Cool to see my shadow there so close. Ah, oh, frack me. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's not so supposed to happen. Um, sometimes if I put my um, gear down, I'm and and I. Oh dear. Oh dear. Yeah, that 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 didn't turn out well. Nice thing is that you don't die. But once I'm on my back, I don't know how to flip myself over again. Because once I'm on back like this, even if I have, well, that's cool. Even if I have the maximum thrust and all, uh, I, it doesn't do anything. I, I'm stuck. And there, there's nothing I can do that I know of. Because I am, I'm screwed. <laughs> I mean, I am really, 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 really screwed. I'm like a turtle on his back. The end. <laughs> God bless it. All right. Well, that was fun. Yeah, let's 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 kill this for now. That was good. That was fun and exciting. Oh yeah, I gotta remember to edit out that bit just prior to fourteen eighteen. It's fourteen thirty nine now. Boy, that was a uh, silliness. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna edit. I'm going to uh, not edit it. I'm going to pause this so that I can go get myself something to drink and such and come back and try to do try to do something else. Hasta la pasta. Oh, how weird. So when I pause and unpause, it says total time recording. It stops. It's like it's Okay, hang on. I'm I'm going to pause it again and test it. Hold on. That is so interesting. It doesn't do total time. Why does it do that? Total time starts from the... Oh, frack me. Alright. Let me pause recording and dang it. Hang on. Alright. Um, am I... It's going... Is this going? It doesn't look like it's going. Hold on. It is going. Fine. Okay. All right, so here's a pile of crap. The very end of chapter six that I've got so far. And there are two things to talk about it. I hate it, but it gives you a step-by-step -step of what's happening so that it can be changed later. Okay, so, and, and here's the thing. Um, 
this is dude talking, then this is a big metal box chain of latches. Now, this makes very little sense, but if you think about it, all I'm doing is putting down information. Think of it as discrete bits of information. Big metal box, then latches jangle. Does it? Is it a sound? Is it a physical thing? I don't know. I think it's supposed to be jangling. You know, the little metal latches clanking or something. I don't know the word for it. And gargling man is just um, some big dude who, when he talks, sounds like he gargles. So I just call him that. That's easier. Maybe I'll never name him. Maybe I'll leave that in like that. And you see, just, just textual stuff. Uh, just uh, statements. These are statements of fact, practically, with a little bit of description and feeling. And then this. And um, this looks. I don't know. I haven't decided. All right, so let's see, what should I do next? Tom, open air plug box. Grab, wait, I don't need to. Oh. <laughs> Stop it. Drive me nuts. Yes, five. Come open the earplug box and grab two box boxes. Box. I don't need to change. I don't need to edit for crying out loud. This is my problem. A problem. You grab two boxes of, box of uh, what? 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 Of um, a. Blah blahs. X two something decibels decibels. See now I'm whatever. See uh, okay. I'm not gonna. Re I'm not going to edit that. Not going to edit decibels and long it on the counter. Excuse me. Gargling. No, I'm gonna, ooh, I'm gonna, oh, Mr. Mr. Man usually I used before though in referencing Herbert. Uh, Herbert's the uh, uh, Florida man dude. So I'm gonna say, I'll do Mr. Gar Mr. Gargle. Hmm. Mr. Gargle. Those shifty eyes. Shifted extra. I don't know. Just for the hell of it. Let's see. Ah, da, 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 what do you do? So I'll change that later, but I get lots of words if I want to do this for nano. And also, it gives me an I it gives me a sense of who this person is. He's shifty, so I make sure he's extra shifty shifty and remind myself and remind everyone else this guy's shifty. And pulled out, and yeah, see now grammatically crappy. Who cares? Pulled out from the bottom. Where the cart? This cart? The cart? His cart? Their cart? The cart? Thou cartest? Quob cart? Alright. Um, hmm. I spell that right? I have no idea if I spelled that right. 
red lacquered wooden pulled out of his cart a red lacquered wooden case and I, I mixed it up doesn't matter um, smell a smeared <laughs> a little like pine salt no 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 I don't want pine salt well yeah pine salt what the hell it's not what I wanted but who cares it's a weird smell or bit like bleach maybe see I'm thinking about that maybe maybe <laughs> so the idea is that we're talking it's oh, see now I want it to smell uh, or something pleasanter and sacred odor like so now that should be in a QQ in fact I'm gonna I'm gonna do that what does QQ QQ mean QQ means I can do a search for QQ in any text document and I will find all my notes and QQ here says I have a note I don't even have to type what it is I'll just look at it and say oh yeah I'm just trying to figure out how this smells just a reminder and uh, obviously I'm not worrying about spelling or I'm trying not to hmm. Mm. Of course, if you're writing Perl, it's not going to be a problem because QQ is used there to mean uh, a particular kind of quoted string. I don't remember how that works. Is it interp interpolated or frack me? I don't remember. But I think QQ is QR, QX, QW. QX is, is execute, I think. QW is quote words. Um. Q R Q X will frack me. Q Q I don't remember. So let's just not worry about that. And here, um, when I do a search for the Q Q string, it'll end up here among other places, and that'll help me um, look at this and zero in on this if I want to. So I'm thinking maybe it'll smell like. Um, I'm not sure what. Maybe a little incensey. Maybe. Um, something slightly old uh, the smell like you might get from a wooden antique sh uh, in an antique in a, in a shop an antique shop um, I'm not sure and, yeah. huh. There's no line, but I put that in there anyway. All right, so uh, that would be Maria, and you notice the violin bow. Well, in this case, she's dealing with a harmonica, because harmonicas are useful too. You can, you can stab people with a harmonica, because they got little sharp corners, right? Stab hard enough, it'll work, maybe. Right? No? Yes? I don't know. Hmm. And so she's very excited about the possibility of stabbing people with harmonicas. I mean, I would be. All right, let's see. Hmm. Hmm. Trying to jump. Oh, gosh. Oh, I want to edit that so badly. Oh, this is one thing I've experimented with. Where is it? Six, right? Yeah. This. Um, I can do that, and you, you know. Yeah, I don't know. That's interesting enough. Where am I? F? How is that? Nice and bright. All right. Hmm. I had Tom open the other one, so maybe Ray opened the case. Oh. 
there. There we go. What? What? Ah, oh, God bless it. Flat, is that the term? I think it's called a flat. We have lots of things laid out and you have several of them. Uh, how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then a big one of nine. Let's just do the math. Nine. Only gas exploded. All. interesting <sighs> okay so look at this this obviously should be up here expose the key a flat of nine harmonicas or something like that and, and you can change that to something else it's a it's a all of this all of this is is, is placeholder okay description with a little bit so this description isn't just a flat-out description there's a little bit, um, a little bit of emotional impact here. All shiny, all shiny, kind of thing. Ooh, a, a little bit of an ooh kind of thing. Um, and then of course this provides the main um, emotional impact. The word gasp. Now. This is just so lacking, and I mean, it it works, but it, there's there's no feeling to it, and that's okay. It is a draft. Oh, oh, what just happened? Oh, frack me, that scared me. <laughs> So I'm using lifted a lot, aren't I? She pulled one of her out from its felt. Felt? Something. See, now what is it? It's not a cushion, it's actually embedded bed. Oh, felt bed. Out, but that indicates that it was encased in something, which it was. I'm imagining they're sunk in 
that it's not just sitting on top. So I'm not sure how I describe it. So I'm going to leave that. There's little holes in it, I don't know. Holes. Uh, flower. Flour. Am I spelling that as a sentence? Above. It's okay. Yeah, it's not too bad. Hmm. Let me think. Sorry. <coughs> I'm about to kill myself. All I did was take a little sip and the dang thing would try to go the wrong way. Hmm. Oh dang. Wow. I do that to myself sometimes. <coughs> My body sucks. And there's an example of that. My brain sucks too. Which is why when I speak, I don't enunciate. There's a relationship there. Yeah. The cash. Hmm. Let me check something here. Uh. My notes fifteen twenty. Mm -hmm. Circa fifteen twenty. Coughing like mad. Now that way I can reduce the sound of that part so I don't boom blow out my eardrums or anyone else's eardrums who might be listening to this. Dear gods. <coughs> Christ on a cracker, that's awful. So they opened the case in the flat of night of mercy. She pulled the harmonica out from its felt bed and peered through its wasn't name. I don't know what they are called. Little play holes or blow holes or whatever. Why'd she give us this? I don't know, maybe it smells good. Just make make shit up. I'm not gonna have her touch it with her and she can't really play it probably because that would be a problem. Alright, let's see. Garbling, gargling. Gargling dude. Fractions. Rest. Uh, uh. Right. No, the breath. No, what? Same.
Hmm. <clears throat> now I'll have to redo that. Um, that's a little too on the nose. No, no, not on the nose. A little too wordy. Yeah. Um, but it's an okay draft uh, for a draft. It's the it, it is the emotional intent. I want gurgling dude to be um, gurgling guy to be gurgling or gurgling gurgling. Yeah, to be very um, comfortable with the situation in a variety of ways. And so that indicates that even though we'll probably have to change it because that's too much. Maybe I don't know. It's okay. It's an experiment. That's not true, it wouldn't have been dramatic if I put that in there anyway. <laughs> Funny. I don't know. But it is discomforting for that poor dude. Um should be commas. And uh then so it's actually really just a plain looking harmonica, but I don't know, it, I don't know. <coughs> Holes? Ugh. Crap. Oh, one word? Okay. Gee, I'm, I'm repeating myself here. This is obviously not well redundant, but that's okay. But hold. Hmm.
Hmm. Oh my gosh, I haven't even reached 15,000. Ugh. Oh my gosh. You know, I think I think that's enough. So I'm gonna have to go back and edit earlier. Let's see what I need to do. Oh, wrong button. There we go. So edit out a big just before 1418 and 1520 oh, another hour later. Um coughing like mad, so I gotta adjust that. I don't know why I did that. I did this for fun. Makes me feel better about the world. Maybe that I can do this. Not that it's exciting or awesome or anything like that, but it's nice to do. It really is nice to do this. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and stop this. And uh, I do appreciate the fact I can do this, even if it doesn't really, you know, mean much to anyone. Yeah. Okay. Goodbye.